Many of us are very weak in the front of our legs due to sedentary lifestyle, too much sitting and not enough exercising. Today, I have a great exercise for you to help strengthen your hip flexors, the muscles in the front of your hips to help you to have stronger hips, legs and knees. Press the back of your pelvis or your bums heavy into the mat. Bring one leg up and stretch that leg towards the ceiling. Lower the leg slowly with control and lift the leg up. Press your tailbone down into the mat and only lift your leg as far as you can keep your pelvis stable, tailbone pressed down. Now try not to press your back into the mat as you lift your leg. The height of the leg is not that important and it is determined by how uh, long your hamstrings muscle are. In order to do this exercise properly, your hip flexor muscles, the front of your legs, must be doing more of the work and not by using momentum and help from your torso. We're looking at isolating these muscles right in the front of your legs here by pressing the tailbone down, keeping the pelvis in a neutral position. Switch sides, bring the other leg up, stretch it, lower that leg, press your tailbone down firmly into the mat, lift that leg, lower down, and lift, lower down, and lift. Notice how I'm trying my best to keep my pelvis stable as I'm working my leg. I can already feel a burn in the front of my leg muscles. Going up, coming down, going up, and then release. Now, if you have a chronic cramping issues in the front of your hips and you are not able to do this exercise, that is likely caused by a weak and underactive deep hip muscle called the psoas. Please check out my psoas rescue playlist. In there, you're gonna find exercise videos for targeting the psoas muscles, and that's gonna help you strengthen this part of the body and to resolve your cramp hip issue. That's it for today. I hope you have enjoyed this exercise. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more exercises like this to strengthen your hips. I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.